What's up everybody, it's Easy, Easy Street Gaming. As I'm making this video, the Valkyrie event is probably just winding down. Probably one of my favorite events. I know I, everyone loves the Valkyrie event. You get Valkyries for like 12 Dark Elixir apiece, so you can build 14 or 15 of them. Uh, spend under 300 in Dark Elixir and have this powerful army. What I've done is I have uh, I'm not going to show any whole attacks. I'm, I'm just kind of showing the highlight reel for the Valkyries. Uh, I use them pretty much the same way every time. So we'll, I'll, I'll just kind of break down how I how I use them. Um, now these are all farming raids. I've actually got a couple videos. I've, I've been uh, struggling making the making videos because of all the stuff that's been going on. I know everyone's hearing about. Uh, the matchups, it's not just uh, our clan that's had it rough. I've watched about 30 different videos and uh, it's, it's out there everywhere. So I've had a kind of a hard time. So I'm going to stay away from that for a little while. <laughs> uh, so yeah, so I kind of made like a highlight reel of the Valkyries. Basically what you're going to do with Valkyries is you're, gonna, you're going to funnel them into the core of the base and either jump them into the core or uh, earthquake them into the core. And save yourself a rage. Sometimes a rage and a heal. Sometimes a rage and a freeze. Well, you know, there's there's a, a bunch. It's all personal preference as long as the rage is in there. And they're so powerful. They're so they're so fast. Uh, they just completely demolish everything. They call this the meat grinder event. <laughs> and that's really Valkyries. They're they're just such a powerful troop. Now, if you've played long enough, you remember when they first buffed the Valkyries and they went from obscurity to the number one troop for a while and then they started leveling them out and then it was kind of hard to three star with them the the go vape was a really popular attack and a lot of people actually went away from the goho and went away from laloon to use the go vape and then it kind of hurt them after a while because they leveled up the valkyries and it was really hard to actually three star with them consistently um, now they're used as like a one two combination with bowlers in the very top part of the of the league play and for farming, even though they are a little bit expensive, they are uh, they are just really good at taking the core out. That's I mean Valkyries, that's what they do. They take the core of the base out. You have to be careful with them going around the outside because they're not that powerful uh, by themselves. It's the group effort that really makes these things uh, great, you know. So here's another replay. These are all Town Hall 10 and 11s. I use Giants. I use wizards. I use um, a queen walk with the warden. A Town Hall 11 account, and you'll see that I'm, I'm starting off each replay kind of where I'm deploying the Valkyries. So really, what you want to do is you want to crack into the base, and you want to get a, get your your build up troops, the giants, the wizards. If you use bowlers, get the bowlers in there too, and then kind of bring up the rear with the Valkyries, and then. Put the rage down. If you can wait on the warden's ability, as soon as the Valkyries hit that rage, you can use the warden's ability. Because remember, the one weakness for the Valkyries, there's actually two that I want to mention. One of the weaknesses for the Valkyries are they will run out in front of the, the help. So if you're using golems with them, which anyone who knows me knows that I use the giants instead of golems because I don't want a healer or three healers on a golem on a wall. Giants will eat the way through the wall, so I use them instead. Um, the Valkyries will outrun any tank, so you have to be careful. Their, you know, their weakness, their strength is also kind of their weakness. Um, number one, number two, if they happen to have a golem in the clan castle and you're not careful, it they are built perfectly to kill Valkyries because they'll split them and damage the Valkyries about halfway, and then when they split the second time, or when they blow the second time, the death damage for the golem that will kill the Valkyries. So if you have 15 Valkyries that all attack one Golem at one time, the Golem will take all of them out unless you're really careful and you, you put a heal or something over them. Now you see, most of the time, uh, and, and this is a common mistake I see a lot of people make, they, they want to, okay, how do I build the best base? So they look at the number one player. And so they build their Town Hall 9 like the number one player and it doesn't work. 
And you'll notice too that the, the guys up top, they've already maxed out their base so they can use their storages as shields. They're not really trying to protect any kind of resources. They're just protecting the trophies. So uh, if you're not if you're not a, um, almost maxed 11, don't copy those top bases. It's going to hurt you. And you'll also notice that they build their, their attacks a little bit differently because they're dealing with uh, a different type of base. They're dealing with a lot of ring bases up there still, believe it or not. And they... they they basically they, they try to build these bases where the core is separate from the rest of the base and it gives the troops somewhere to go other than in. So those are really popular bases up top and the very top of the game. So you'll see that's why you see a lot of the bowler valks built. Um, now the bowler valk is when you use uh, usually you use an archer queen walk charge whatever you want to call it, and you use uh, her. The warden and, and like eight to ten or twelve uh, bowlers. And this attack right here, I'm using eleven. And you'll kind of let the attack go for a while, and you'll push your push your way pretty deep into the base with the queen, with the healers, with the bowlers, uh, and clear out enough to where you can follow your original troops in with the Valkyries. You're not going to come in a second place with the Valkyries. You're going to come in the exact same hole that you came in with your original kill squad. And you'll basically follow the kill squad in, into the wreckage that the kill squad has left. And if you've done a good enough job with the kill squad, there won't be anything to attract the Valkyries except for the core. And then you can put a jump on the core and then raise the Valkyries up on the core. And if you've been watching as I've been running my mouth, the Valkyries completely annihilate the core of every single one of these bases. It's pretty much a no contest. I had, <laughs> I had so many good Valkyrie attacks today that I actually have another video coming out. Um, that I'm just going to highlight a different part of the, the Valkyrie attack and uh, talk about something else that was going on that I saw too, which was this this dead base. Uh, I saw 30 dead bases out of maybe 40 looks, which is kind of concerning to see so many. Now, granted, I did like getting the loot, <laughs> all, the, all the dead bases, but there was a lot. But that was down on Crystal, that was a little easy. So uh, if you notice too, these are much shorter videos, kind of paying attention, people don't watch 10 minute videos, they watch 5 or 6 minute videos, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to kind of cut out some of the, uh, the fluff and just give everyone uh, the core attacks, unless we're really getting into some details. So this is the Valkyries, use them to take out the core of bases, make sure you use other troops ahead of them to funnel them into the base, because you don't want them to go around because they get picked off. Uh, they've changed, guys, they've changed YouTube. Easy finally gets in with monetization. I, it, you had to have 100 uh, subscribers. You had to have 10,000 views. Whatever it was, I, you know, I make that humbly. Now they've changed it to 1,000 subscribers, which is a much larger mountain for me to climb. So give, help me out. Uh, sub to the channel, guys. G go watch one of the 200 videos we have in there. Like the video if you like the video. I do appreciate everyone for watching. Till next time, it's been easy.